mentioned in there by Jay, if you get a chance, read that article, uh, Jace Robertson um, article about him and the metal detecting and stuff like that. If you get a chance, go check it out. Uh, So it was a nice little surprise that uh, I was in American Digger magazine this month. So go check that out. I'll I'll probably post something. I haven't posted anything yet, but I'll probably post something about it. But it was pretty cool to, um, it was an honor to be mentioned by Jace um, in there in the article. And um, anyway, just wanted to share that with you. If y'all haven't uh, gotten the new American Digger magazine, uh, get a chance, check it out. Uh, Jace got an interesting story in there. So, yeah, and if you haven't got it yet, it's on its way. I got home Sunday to it sitting. I'm like, yay! <laughs> yeah, mine was sitting there for two days, and it was funny. Like my mother was like, "If you're not gonna look at that, I'd love to look at it and read it." And she's like, "I said, well, somebody told me I might be in that one." And she's like, hollers at me from the other room, "You're in." And guess what? Jason mentioned you. That's awesome. Very (laughs) cool. Really cool. Really cool. That is very cool. Okay, I think we are ready. I think we are ready. Um, So I have 14. Okay. Just one second. I'm typing. Uh, let's see, 14, we've got 14 for our random generator. All right, y'all ready? (laughs) Sorry. Uh, I've never had this happen, but this is fun. Uh, you ready for the winning number? Yes. Number one. Number one was Mike Chamberlain. Yay, Mike. Awesome. Winner. Mike is such an awesome guy. Everybody, Yay, make Mike. sure you, you head over for Relic Roundup at 9 o'clock after. And thanks, Jeff, for joining us. Um, congratulations, Mike. I'm going to put a, the um, email address if you can... Um, Send your yeah, send us send us your address. You can also send it to just one of us or oh, yeah. or she's got the email address in there. And uh TV dot treasure vortex at gmail dot com. Yep. I can never remember that. Uh, it's I believe <laughs> me, if I can if I can find the owner of I can't the, remember anything. <laughs> the treasure vortex. Well I should have just done the treasure vortex LLC because we are the only owners of that. And our phone number. Do we have enough time to have a call in phone number before we close tonight? We we have one more It would be um, a short, short call. Yep, if you oh, want to do another sticker pack? Yep, one more sticker pack and then Okay, um, one more sticker pack, folks. Uh, we got the same amount of people. We just had somebody else join, though. I just saw somebody else. I thought um, it looked like another. Is it Brooklyn Treasure Hunter? That's Anthony. That's Anthony. Oh, so. Maybe I'm seeing things. No, oh, I smell brownies. I just, I just oh, went back gosh. through. Nobody else. Oh, somebody just made brownies. Oh. So actually, do uh, one through thirteen. That way we don't 13? have Mike. Did we yeah. lose somebody? Oh, okay, Mike. Or I should do, well, if he's number one. Well, I crossed, well, yeah, that's true. Oh, you crossed it out. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Y'all ready? So what am I doing? Hold on. What I'm numbers? changing it. I'm changing everybody's number. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Uh, four. So if you're still in here, just keep hanging Six, out for a minute. See if you're the winner seven, of the eight. next sticker pack. He did change his, his pick. That's why it confused me. <laughs> nine. Nine. Ten. So something interesting, just wanted to to bring this up while she's changing that 
Um, I started watching a new series on Amazon Prime uh, called The Peripheral, and it's feature-based. Now, I haven't gotten that far in. I'm just on episode three. But uh, Ken King uh, had posted something of a screenshot of um, someone wearing uh, a pull tab around their neck in the episode. And it's supposed to have like futuristic stuff. It's it's really neat, very sci-fi, futuristic, time travel thing. Uh, I'm really loving it so far. But um, it was really interesting that she was wearing a pull tab around her neck, and as a um, like a relic or something kind of uh, of the past, you know, um, in 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 the show. So I'm anxious to find out. Or, or see that I haven't noticed it yet because I'm only on episode three, but I'm going to go down and after the podcast tonight and watch some more of it tonight because I shared it with my family. So go watch it with my family. So I'll watch the first episode again. So if y'all get a chance, y'all might want to check it out. Uh, you might find it interesting too, but it's interesting to think what could possibly be considered relics in the future um, of something of the past. And, uh, of course, our greatest nemesis as metal detectorist is the pull tab. So, And I think Mike had put, uh, commented this when I, uh, on, on his comment. It's interesting to know the newer pull tabs, when you twist them around, did you know you could, they're actually, that hole there is for you to put your straw in? Huh. Did you know that? I, I didn't did know that. So, Mike... Thank you for that tidbit of information as well. Are y'all ready? So numbers one through what? 13. Or 13? Yep. All right. Uno, dos, 13. All right. You ready? Drum roll. Drum roll. Okay. Number 10. Number 10. Is the lucky winner. Is Jackie. Whoever that is. Jackie. Yay. Awesome. Congratulations, Jackie. Thank you all for playing Woo-hoo! along. We have eight minutes. So all right. do we what have do time you, for a quick caller? What do you want to do? Well. Does anybody actually want to call in? And, does anybody and... want to call in and just say hi or share something quick with us? Anybody? Oh, well, if someone says yes in chat, then I'll give the phone number again. Yeah. But, okay. Um, it's one of those, you know, you know, oh, the season is almost done. Is there something you're still hoping to find? Is there something you found this year that just blew you away? Um, anything like that? <laughs> yeah, anything like that. For those of you that don't know Jackie, um, I mentioned her earlier in chat. Uh, I was de- detecting with her last week, but... She has had a detector for quite some time and finally gotten it out of the closet and started using it, and she took it to the Mississippi River a while back and found something really cool, and um, she had found this old boat light that is just amazing, and she's got it in her, um, she has two, she has her own business, um, and she's got it in her little shop whatever she put a light in it it looks so cool oh that's so um cool she says she's gonna put put uh let's see space for her stickers on her new she got a brand new shovel from um predator tools i think so yeah anyway um and she found her first silver coin last week so I'll be sure and be looking for the upcoming videos with Jackie in it. And also uh, she went on our trip with uh, Shauna, uh, which is in chat as well, um, w- that I had talked about the previous week for my birthday week and weekend. They took me on a trip, uh, a surprise uh, trip to go crystal digging and um Anyway, it was a blast, and um, I had a point to my story, and I can't remember what it was. 
But anyway, we, uh, yeah, oh, and Jackie went with us. Shauna, uh, Shauna's another fairly new metal detector. She's a local, lives right up the road from me, uh, that has had two metal detectors. Um, so her and I've been out. She took me out on my birthday. Um, me too. Ready to go back. Uh, we're ready to go back and dig crystals. Next time, what we might have to plan, ladies, is we'll have to plan a trip where Amanda can fly here. We'll fly her in, and she can go with us because it was such a blast. Oh, my gosh. Just such a blast. That would be awesome. And there was another point I was making in that story, but I can't remember what it was. Uh, but anyway, all right, we're about out of time now, folks. I don't know if we're going to have time for a call anyway. No. But um, y'all be sure and go to uh, Jeff is going to be on it's Relics Radio right after this. Um, I think it's on Spreaker as well, isn't yep. it? Or it is. Radio. Okay. So. Y'all go and listen to Jeff. Jeff's a great guy. In fact, uh, Squirrel is so right, Shauna. <laughs> I get easily distracted. But um, anyway, Jeff is a great friend, great detectorist, and um, love the guy. So y'all go support them, and we love you all, and you all have a fabulous night and a fabulous, 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 thanksgiving and we've all got a lot something to be thankful for so um most of all i'm thankful for my special co-host and friend amanda digger to god and all of you uh listeners i love you all and you all have a happy thanksgiving love happy thanksgiving everyone and i hope you have a safe and happy week um, enjoy the food, enjoy your company, and uh, we'll catch you next Monday. All right. Good night, everyone.